Well, hello everyone. This is Richard Kadish, owner and broker in charge of Go Gated Realty, Hilton Head Island and Bluffton, South Carolina. And today is September 25th, 2018. We're at the beach on Hilton Head Island at the Hilton Head Island Beach and Tennis Resort. We're on the balcony of Ocean View Unit Number B as in Boy 242. And this villa has just been listed with my company, Go Gated Realty, for $199,000. We're just a few steps off of the beach here in the Folly Field area. Uh, this is a furnished vacation villa that has one bedroom, one bathroom. It's just 540 square feet, so it won't take us long to walk through this. But we'll also walk down to the ocean. I'll show you the big oceanfront swimming pool and the cabana bar. We'll talk uh, more about the resort as we go along. Let's just take a quick look here at this villa. And it's being sold furnished. It has the living room, dining area out here combination. Now many people use these in different ways. You can see in this case the dining room table is set over here against the wall and that's not being used by this occupant. The kitchen has been renovated and is the wraparound renovation, meaning that it turns the corner and so many of these that have the efficiency kitchens, they're just on the wall, one wall there. We do have the full size refrigerator. And again, the furnishings are included. We have a laminate floor very beachy. It's got the light beach color. And this can be your getaway on Hilton Head Island at the beach for just $199,000. You'll have to make all those big decisions like do you go to the beach before lunch or after lunch? That sort of thing. These are the types of decisions you have to make when you own at the beach on Hilton Head Island. But what most people do, of course, if they're not buying it just for themselves, is that they uh, rent it out to others, either on their own or with the on-site vacation rental company, or through other kinds of social media sites that are on the web these days. We have just the one bathroom here. Easy to show it to you. Your water heater and your air handler are in those closets. Your heat pump is actually on the roof. And here you have built-in bunk beds so that the villa actually can sleep six if you want. Two in the living room on the sofa bed, two in the hallway bunks, and then two in the bedroom, which is here. If we were to go into six or eight different villas like this, we would see six or eight different looks in the way that they're decorated, the types of furniture, We'll just take another quick look in this direction. Give you a sense of how it is coming into the villa, looking out to the balcony. There's actually 498, 498 of these ocean villas, one bedroom ocean villas here at the resort, 498. And looking back then at the configuration of the buildings A, B, and C, we're in the B building, B242, which means second floor. Looking towards the A building, you can see that these buildings are three stories high. The best views come from the second and third floors. The most economical ones are typically on the first floor. And you're either very close to the front, like so, or you go to the back where the hallway splits into a Y formation and that's where your elevator is located there at the where the where the hallway splits. But there's a, a lot of uh, locations with different views. 
everyone decorated differently. These little boardwalks take you out to the beach. The monthly regime fee for the ocean villas here at Beach and Tennis is $415. And the regime fee itself is just actually $270 but you also have a mandatory $58 a month insurance payment for your hurricane, fire, and flood insurance. They have a $36 monthly reserve, which is necessary so you don't get special assessments. And then finally a mandatory $51 for cable, internet, and phone. The uh, resort here does have kind of like a hotel phone system, and that's for calling up to the front desk like in a hotel or from room to room, all of that, then $415 is your mandatory monthly payment. Well, let's take a walk up to the beach. We can talk more about the resort as we go. This is the center hallway and close to the front, which is where the beach and the ocean is. Now elsewhere at the resort, just for your general interest, they also have two bedroom villas. There's a category called tennis villas that are kind of like second row properties. They're away from the beach, from these ocean villas. There's 168 of those. They start in the mid ones, meaning roughly 150,000 and up. And then we have an Admiral's Row building, which has both one and two bedrooms. The two bedroom ocean views there start typically in the $200,000 range. There's 140 of those, and another 41 bedrooms over there. The total price range for these ocean villas today, according to our MLS, range from 112,000 up to 239,000. That's 112 to 239. That's everything from first floor with no view, perhaps in fixer-up type condition, up to 239, which would give you a direct ocean front, like perhaps one of these that we're looking at now, with this stairway down to the ground. And that's your total price range. The uh, market, uh, could be summarized for these types of villas as, hey, we're back. Uh, during the recession, the interest and demand for condominiums fell way off. These are luxury purchases, optional purchases that people buy to celebrate their success, enjoy their prosperity with family and friends. Uh, some people regard them as investments where they rent out and get cash flow. And your cash flow, your possible tax benefits, the use benefit, the appreciation, all of these things can add up to a good deal. And of course, many people just buy them for themselves, for their personal use. They pay cash, they have a place at the beach. There are so many motives and different types of people buying for different reasons but this is really your most economical location. Well, let's just say it's among the most economical locations on Hilton Head Island to buy a beach villa. We're talking here under 200,000 for an ocean view villa, even from the low ones, and two bedrooms from the mid ones. It's the kind of thing that is very affordable to many people and is what they're looking for. Always a popular location here, Hilton Head Island Beach and Tennis Resort. So here we are at the beach complex. Right ahead of us here we have a snow cone uh, uh, little store here that's not open at the moment. But over here is the big oceanfront swimming pool. I believe that this is the biggest pool on Hilton Head Island. I believe it is the biggest. And then over here, we have Jamaica Joe's, which is their oceanfront cabana bar. They do serve liquor there. So it's a family-friendly place. They have food, they have drinks, alcoholic beverages, as well as snow cones and hot dogs for the 
kids and the family. It's quite a, quite a popular spot. A lot of villas here in the economy range in the context of Hilton Head Island where of course condominiums go right on up in price. You can spend a lot of money here but on the island in general but at the beach and tennis resort in a couple of locations you can save money or buy more economically. Now this is not a pet friendly location. One of the questions that I get all the time if people are bringing their pets on vacation. No, you can't have them here. We have to find a pet friendly location for you elsewhere. Uh, some of those locations are a little farther from the beach where when you're looking at annual residents where they live uh, then you get more pet friendly but up on the beach especially with these high density villas and that I mean number of units per acre then you typically uh, have a no pets rule. And so here we are at the beach. That didn't take long at all. Beautiful sand out here. It's a beautiful day on April 25th, 2018. As you might imagine, it's very difficult showing beachfront properties. Uh, it takes uh, a certain amount of patience to come out here and be with the vacationers in their swimsuits. That's uh, kind of real estate humor, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, what a beautiful day. What a beautiful day. This is the Hilton Head Island Beach, which stretches all the way from the toe of the foot, Hilton Head Island shaped like a foot, from the toe of the foot, which is down at South Beach and Sea Pines, right through the middle of the arch of the foot, which is approximately where Palmetto Dunes is located, right up through this Folly Field area, and on then to the north, northernmost part of the beach, which is up actually in Port Royal Plantation. That minty green roof that you see there in the distance is actually the Weston Hotel. So from the beach here, you can walk over to the Weston for breakfast, lunch, or dinner, or ride your bike right on down the beach. I did tell you, I, I tell you more about the resort. The Hilton Head Resort itself does have a, uh, a, a sports lounge. It has a pizzeria. It has a fitness center. It has 10 tennis courts that are lighted. Uh, they have uh, on-site rental management. And it has a 24-hour guarded security gate. Again, that monthly fee is just $4.15. The price of this villa, $1.99. The total price range being today, $112 to $239 for those ocean villas. The other categories have different prices. I would just invite you to give me a call. Let's talk, let's get acquainted. I'll be happy to work with you and find the right vacation villa or primary residence, second home, whatever you need. I have 42 years of Hilton Head Island and Bluffton real estate experience. I'm here to help you to find the right property for you to meet your budget and your needs. Let's work together. And it's very hard for me to end these videos, by the way. When I walk down to the beach, I tend to go on and on. so. I won't blame you if you turn me off, but let me give you my contact information. Uh, my cell number is 843-684-2933. That's 843-684-2933. My email address, rich at gogated.com. That's R-I-C-H at G-O-G-A-T-E-D.com. And my website, is gogated.com. So please contact me via cell phone, my website or email. At my website you can give me a message that says uh, tell me about your real estate needs and that's where you can tell me a bit about yourself, your budget, your timetable and I can send you a list of all of the properties here at the resort and other resorts that might work for you meet your price, meet your needs, but uh, 
And typically what I do is I correspond with a buyer for some time before you come down and then you know everything that's for sale and we go out and see it. What a beautiful day. Well, this is the, the beach here on Hilton Head Island. The resort has private access to the beach and beautiful sand. All the memories that you have time to make here at the Hilton Head Island Beach and Tennis Resort. Well, thank you for watching the video. I look forward to hearing from you. If you like the video, there are more at the Go Gated channel on YouTube. Please subscribe. I hope that the audio, <laughs> that the wind didn't affect the audio too much on this video, but I would be surprised if it didn't. Thank you again. I look forward to hearing from you about your real estate needs on Hilton Head Island or Bluffton, South Carolina.